Karl Theodor zu Gutenberg is the star of German politics. The 39-year-old defense minister outshines all with his ever-high popularity ratings. A favorite with the tabloids and the yellow press. Of royal blood, a man of action, well-mannered and educated. In parliament he now had to answer allegations that he had plagiarized a major portion of his doctoral thesis. Ich war sicher, so hochmütig zu glauben. As a young father, I was arrogant and thought I could mix political passion and work with scientific and intellectual challenges. Obviously, I was overloaded. Miteinander in Einklang zu bringen. His PhD thesis was therefore flawed. Shortly after the allegations of plagiarism first surfaced last week, Sir Gutenberg called them absurd. On Friday he temporarily renounced his title. On Monday he asked the University of Bayreuth to take it back entirely. The opposition was outraged, called him a forger, a liar and a cheat. If Zu Gutenberg does not have the decency to step down, then the Chancellor has to fire him. Evidence had been overwhelming, and the Internet played an important role in gathering it. The page Gutenplug Wiki found copied sections without attribution on 286 pages of his thesis. Too many to speak of mere mistakes, the opposition argued. Gutenberg's own cohort, though, remains convinced of his qualities. The important thing is that he is the right minister in the right place. Chancellor Merkel remained absent as her minister was grilled in parliament. She's on record as saying that he was appointed as minister of defense and not as an academic assistant. If the court proves this has been intentional, he will have a criminal record and a high fine. Also, he won't be able to stay in office. Ist er nicht mehr haltbar. The University of Bayreuth has already announced to strip zu Gutenberg of his title. His thesis did not comply with academic standards. The public, though, seems unimpressed. According to a recent poll, his popularity ratings are now even higher than they were before the affair. Defense Minister Sir Gutenberg apologized for the apparent mistakes in his PhD thesis, but he will not step down. The opposition had strongly called for the resignation of the minister, who had cheated and lied, but it seems he can count on the backing of Chancellor Merkel. He might have to face legal charges, though. Stefan Hermann, Press TV, Berlin.